Hello everyone. Everyone. <laughs> Welcome everyone. So this is the making of my meat sauce. Obviously it starts with the best thing in the world which is bacon and the bacon fat. So stay tuned as I show you how I put everything together. So after cooking some bacon in this beautiful Dutch oven that's actually seven quarts, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this sauce together. I'm going to add some onions, garlic, and a couple other things, so uh, stay tuned. So I fried up some bacon, and uh, uh, we actually have the leftover bacon grease. I added some olive oil, and now we are going to add one whole onion, five cloves of garlic. This is the bacon that I fried up. And we're gonna let this cook for a minute before we put everything else, so stay tuned. So you have the bacon marinating with the uh, onions and the garlic, salt and pepper. And we're going to use about a cup of your favorite red wine. Look how beautiful. And normally what I do, look at that, look at the sound. So what I like to do, I actually raise the uh, flames all the way to damn near high. And we're going to reduce it to get rid of the alcohol. So stay tuned for the next step. So after a couple of minutes, we've let the uh, alcohol basically leave this dish. We're going to add 12 ounces of uh, tomato paste. The reason we're putting 12 ounces is because I actually love a very thick sauce. If you like a thinner sauce, just add uh, more water and not necessarily so much tomato paste. So let me blend all of these flavors in before I add the San Marzano tomatoes, which are imported from Italy. I certainly recommend them. They are the best tomatoes in my opinion. So let's blend this before we add the uh, beautiful tomatoes. Look at this. That looks great. And now look at this. Look how beautiful that is. That actually caught me in my eye, but that's pretty funny. <laughs> look how nice. Every time that happens, you add something else, please add a little bit more salt and pepper, okay? And last but certain not least, here is fresh basil. It's about a, I don't know, a couple tablespoons of fresh. Here's a tablespoon of dry basil. And we need a little heat. So let's get uh, some red pepper flakes. And stay tuned, we're gonna cook this soup uh, thing down for a couple hours. 